and I'm very happy to uh, welcome our CNO of the University Hospital, um, Mr. Frédéric Boiron, who will give us some uh, word about uh, our campus and uh, will welcome us. I'm very happy to lead this uh, university hospital. You know, we have uh, one of the, the largest university hospitals in France. Thank you for, for this. And we are very um, happy that we are uh, invited to do to organize this in one of the big centers in France for rare diseases. So we are very happy and proud to welcome the ANICA meeting, annual meeting here in Lille. It's a unique opportunity to have face-to-face -face discussion and to share our common knowledge and also expectation for the future. Uh, it's really great to be here in Lille to be at this uh, first meeting since the pandemic and uh, I'm looking forward to more conversations with our colleagues. It's very important to remember that uh, the ERNs are all about improving the outcomes for, for patients and it's important to bring the patient perspective to these meetings which I hope I can successfully do with my colleagues. I'm very happy that we have our first meeting in this COVID period again here in Lille uh, which is the centre of rare diseases from France and they have marvellous facilities here uh, and it's look uh, very nice to meet our uh, family here, the Ernica family, uh, where we are looking to the congenital malformations of the intestine. It's a rare diseases and we're starting to uh, have a new view on a lot of topics and it's very heartwarming that we can see each other and improving our uh, network. Yeah, this is my first Ernica meeting uh, and I really enjoy uh, being here because as pediatric surgeons we tackle rare diseases and therefore I really do think that it's so important to have a European-wide initiative bringing together researchers, patient representatives and all the people that are dealing with, with these diseases and by meetings like this and by Ernica uh, we will be able to improve our service to, to our patients.